right, people, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another video, and it is time once again to open my mail in front of the camera because you freaking love it and you know you do. At least I hope you do because I have a huge backlog of these videos I have yet to put up, and it would suck if nobody liked these. Uh, I'm assuming people like them because they get a decent amount of views. Uh, not as many views as, like, my Gore's recent Game Pickups videos, but whatever. You know, hey, yeah, they're, not, they're, all, they're not all gonna be winners. You know, <laughs> I've proved that many times in the past where I would get a thousand views on this video and then about 20 views on the next. Um, that's not true, I don't think I've ever gotten 20 views, but fingers crossed it, it never gets that bad. But anyway, I got one package this time, even though I held up two fingers, just one. Just one, and but it's chunky one. Look at this one. Woo! That's a good like eight to ten pounds. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not a scale because you know if I step on one, I'll break one. <laughs> uh, it's kind of fat, but uh, I am excited to open this because this comes from somebody on OfferUp that uh, I just saw a listing, a random listing um, that someone put up of a bunch of cases let's just say i don't want to spoil it but i kind of did already um i ain't gonna say what it is it is gaming related so it's a bunch of cases no games inside them but cases and they wanted 25 dollars for it and they had they had some good cases in there uh ones that i actually did want uh but there's another reason why i wanted those cases and i'll explain as i start showing what's in here i don't want to spoil what's in there because obviously the mystery is the is, the, is a captivating part of this uh, unboxing i would say i I would assume at least, but uh, sorry if I'm stumbling on my words. I'm still sick, and I also have a a cough, a cough drop, a cough, a cough. I can't say cough, cough, cough. I got a cough drop in my mouth, but um, and I'm also sick, but uh, and I have a stuffed nose. Also, I'm tired, and I'm also dumb. I'm a, I'm a very dumb person. But uh, anyway, they had a bunch of cool stuff, and we, we started talking and stuff, and it seems like she has a lot of cool stuff she wants to get rid of. So we're making deals. I don't want to say what her name is, just in case they don't want to know, but it uh, starts with an L. So just in case they're watching, you know who I'm talking to. Also, you'll know exactly because you shipped this box, so you know who you are, obviously. I don't want to say the name just in case they don't want to be addressed by their first name. But um starts with an L and ends with a, uh, an N. There you go. So anyway, let's get to it. Let's open this box because I'm excited. Um, also, I should shout her out because she actually sent me a bunch of extra stuff in here, which was really, really cool. We got talking on Facebook and stuff. She actually sent me a bunch of pictures of the stuff she wanted to sell. And we're making deals. We're making deals. So she was really cool. She spent a lot of money on the shipping, too. I should mention that. Way more than... I don't even think she's like making anything from it, to be honest, which really sucks. Um... But if we make some deals on the other stuff, hopefully that will be cool. Um, we'll, we'll work some out. I might send her some extra stuff. But anyway, let's get to it. Let's open this. All right, here we go. Um, should I sh give you a sneak peek? That's all you get. That's all you get. So, all right, all right. Let's pull out this thing first. Uh, because she sent me a bunch of pictures, and it was really cool. She sent me a bunch of cool stuff. First thing she sent me that was extra. This is, this, these are just the extras. I'm going to show you the extras first. Um... Uh, she sent me a DVD of The Legend of Zelda, the complete season, meaning the complete series, I believe, because I think there was only one season, right? Um, I never really watched this as a kid. Uh, I think this was, like, maybe, like, late 80s, early 90s. I think probably, no, 89. I was actually close. Um, I, I, I watched a little bit of it, but I never really got into it or anything. Um, and that's cool. I thought the collection, I have the Super Mario Brothers Super Show, which is, uh, is that what this is advertising? No, it's just Mario. Um, and uh, that's cool. So uh, I'll keep that in the collection. Uh, thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, this was really cool. Uh, speaking of Zelda, uh, I guess she got this at GameStop. It's a Wind Waker glass. Look at this. Of Zelda. And I will open it. And uh, show it off. Look at that. Wow, that's really cool looking, actually. So Look at that. You got him shooting an arrow. And you got him looking pissed. Yeah, he's about to come at you. So, uh, that's really cool. So, thank you for that. That was really cool. Very cool. A little Red Lair Media. Ugh. All right. And uh, the one thing she said that she, like, give me that I thought was really, really kind of her, because I actually don't have this in my collection. Um, I was like, whoa, that's really cool, because I think this goes, this might go for a little bit, I'm not, I, I haven't looked, I'm keeping this in my collection, though, and that is the Steelbook for Uncharted, 
a Thief's End, Uncharted 4, sorry, a Thief's End, which I actually had this at one point. Um, I got rid of it because I was done with the game, because I got the collector's edition of this. Um, is the statue? No, you, you've seen the statue in the in the past, I believe. It used to be like right behind me, but it's not there anymore. Um, but uh, yeah, so I got rid of it after I was done with the game because I wanted to recoup some of my money, because that's how it goes. And uh, yeah, the game's in there too. They didn't even need to send me the game. I have the game, but the freaking steelbook's awesome, so... Thank you so much. I got that. I need to get another cough draw. This one's getting low. But, uh, all right. So, hey, what is this? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, that's cool. I know these were, I think these were pre-order bonuses at some place or something for Doom. She knows I like Doom because she mentioned, I, she looked at my Facebook and I had a bunch of Doom stuff on my Facebook. Um, and she saw, oh, you like Doom? I got Doom stuff. She sent me these. I didn't even know that. Maybe she said that in one of the videos. She posted me a lot of videos. She wanted to show off what what she had. There you go. That's really cool. You got the Kaka Demon. You got the, is it the Revenant? Revenant. And then, I, I don't want to read the back of them. And the uh, Mancubus. Yeah, I got it right. There you go. The Kaka Demon. I have a Kaka Demon right there. Look at that. Can you see him? Yeah, you can see him. All right. So now let's get to, the, to what I actually paid for. Um... Thank you so much, though. Those are really cool. I actually really like these cards. I'm pretty sure those were like pre-order exclusive somewhere. I don't know where, but I never got them. So those will go to my uh, my steelbook for Doom, actually, because I got the collector's edition. All right, so just re I'll give you a quick glimpse again. Here go. Wham! You already saw. You already saw. Just pause the video and look at the stuff, and then you can stop watching this video. <laughs> I'm sure you want to. But I got a bunch of, of DS card, uh, boxes. Most of these I'm going to keep... Because I want to use some of these. If you do not know, uh, I have a pretty good GBA collection. And what I do... Here, I'll even show you some of them. I've printed out. I print out boxes for GBA games. And I use DS cases. Um, it doesn't really fit perfectly. Because every printer that I, I have... Not that I have. That I use. Which is library and stuff like that um don't don't ever print them out the exact size but they but they look good so i, I print them out and i i buy nintendo ds uh cases just for that and i have like maybe 15 gba games right now that i really want to make into uh those so those look just really cool and i really like that besides them just being you know, whatever. So I bought a bunch of these uh, DS cases. Some of them I'm actually going to keep because these are games that uh, if I do get in the future. And a couple of them I might uh, put up online just to try to recoup some of my money. Um, but I think most of these I'm going to keep. I'm definitely going to keep the lower, like the, the more, I guess, shovel war games. But there's a lot of good stuff here. So let's get through it. Through it. Um, first off, I got Gardening Mama. Disney Princess Magical Jewel. Magical Jewels. Of course, that's a classic. Um, Cooking Mama. She, watch out, she's gonna freaking... She's gonna hack you or whatever. That new, what was the story about that new game? Like, if you bought it and played it, it would hack you or something? I don't know. Tinkerbell. And here's a 3DS game, Minecraft, which I actually don't have. That... I should. I could be opening these, but I'm, I'm not going to. They're all going to be empty anyway. Um, some of them might have the boxes or whatever, but uh, I'm not too sure. All right, next section right here. Got a Sonic Rush, which I actually have that cart only, so that's complete. Little Mermaid, that's a classic. Final Fantasy III, which I have cart only, so there you go. Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks, which I actually have this case, but... It is complete. All right, cool. It's not complete, the one I have. At least I don't think it is. So this is complete, so I'm going to take this stuff out and then just do whatever with this. Um, so that's cool. This is from Hello Kitty. Ah, that's a gem. That's a gem. That's a gem. All right, let's pull out some more here. Let's pull out some more. Here you go. All right. I love horses. Spongebob, Boat and Bash. Boating Bash? I'm going to say Boat and Bash, because that sounds cooler. Also, my sickness and impediment. I got Zelda. <laughs> impediment has made it so that I cannot say words. Um, but anyway, Phantom Hourglass, so I have that. I already have that. But is this with the manual? No, it just has one of the uh, inserts. Um, that one I'll probably get rid of. 
Super Princess Peach. She uses an umbrella. Watch out. She cries. That's one of her abilities. <laughs> it's a little offensive, but it, it was a it was a harmless game. <laughs> I like finally Princess Peach gets her own game. What does she do? She fucking cries. All oh, good. That's great. Build a bear workshop. Now that's an example of a case I'll be using. I just bit down on that cough drop because I'm a fucking rebel. Um, yeah, watch out. Watch out. <laughs> watch out, you cough drops. I'm going to get you. Um, but that's an example of one I'll use as a GBA case. Learn math. I'm trying. It's hard. Barbie grooming glam pups. Dog abuse. Mario and Luigi Battles Inside Story, which I do not... I don't have this one, right? Yeah, no, I don't have this one. I do. I do now. <laughs> is one of the, I don't have the case for this one, but I do have it loose. So now I have the case. And it feels like it's... Oh, it, it's complete, baby. So that's going in my collection. A lot of these will go in my collection. Uh, this one's actually really cool. I didn't know it had like a little slipcover. Plants vs. Zombies? Look at that. I think I might have this one loose. I'm not too sure about that one. I might be wrong. But uh, that's really cool. I never knew it had like a slipcover. That's I've never seen a slipcover for a DS game. That's really cool. Um, this one's just a GameStop case, and you know how I feel about those, so those go fuck off. Um, what's this? Virtual Villagers? A New Home. I've never heard of this. It's kind of cool. I like obscure games. It looks like a... like a, Almost like a Sims game if it was set on a tropical island. I'm assuming they're... Uh, yeah, okay. A few survivors from a lost tribe are stranded on the island of Al As Asola. Only you can save them. I ain't gonna save them. I ain't playing this shit. It is, I'm assuming, complete. That's kind of cool, actually. Um, Jewel Master Egypt. Alright, this one's kind of cool, actually. Uh, Metroid Samus Returns. I do have this game, but I only have the... Um, the um, special edition, which I know. I only have the special edition. Um... But, uh, so now I have the, I guess the regular one. 3DS cases I don't really need. I don't really have a lot of, I mean, I guess I could use them as Game Boy cases too. I'm sure a Game Boy game, well, actually, no one. I don't have no game. I'm, I was thinking DS. DS games would fit in there. Never mind. These are useless to me. Um, Chocolatier? Is that what it's called? Yeah, Chocolatier? You like chocolate? Come over to my house. We'll make some chocolate. Uh, Super Mario DS 64. Oh god, I'm about to sneeze. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Oh shit. Titanic! Watch out. If I was on the Titanic, I would be dead. Also, I would be dead anyway because that happened over 100 years ago. And yeah, that would be the oldest man alive. Especially that survived the Titanic. But no, it's because I'm a fat guy. I would be dead. No, it wouldn't be Leonardo DiCaprio who died, but he had a nice he had a nice you know scene before he died. You know, I love you. Go on, get on the door or whatever. Kirby Superstar Ultra. I don't have the case for this, but I do have it loose. So now I have it complete. You goddamn right. I do love I love collecting DS games. Honestly, Legendary Starfy. I believe I have this card only. So this and it's complete, baby. Oh yeah. Had a good death scene. He saved it. Whatever. Anyway, Batman, ba Brave and the Bold, the video game. Uh, the game on the Wii was actually pretty good. I, I believe I reviewed that back in the day. Pretty fun. Never watched the show. I heard the show was pretty good too. Uh, Lego Ninjago Battles, or maybe it's Battles Ninjago. I know what Ninjago is. There it is. Namco Museum DS, which is cool. I, I don't think I have that. And that one I might keep just in case uh, I find it. Of course, you gotta have new Super Mario Bros. Of course, of course. Don't 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 mess around. You need that. You need that in your collection. You know who you are. And the last game is oh, this is just Lego Battles. Okay, so it is Battles. This is just a Jago version. And uh, that's it. So cool. A bunch of cases. Um, a lot of them I'm gonna keep for. Oh God! Uh, oh Jesus! Whew. For uh, GBA cases, um, 
I put Vaseline up in my nose and that was not a good idea. I had Vaseline right right here. If, if my lip looks shiny, is it because that helps with the um, unclogging of the nose? And when I did this, it went up and I don't, I don't recommend shoving Vaseline up your nose. That's not a good idea. Um, not all the way up your nose, at least. It didn't hurt. It just, like, it was too much. Anyway, there you go. That is <clears throat> the unboxing. Very weird unboxing. But I think, um, I was about to say her name. <laughs> Thank you to you know who you are, L, not the Death Note guy, just L. Um, but this is really cool. I really appreciate this. I really appreciate this and the cup. Really cool. Um, that's really cool. I love Uncharted. So, and now I have a complete Uncharted collection on the PS4. At least actually, I have I have all three of the PS3 games. So I have a complete Uncharted collection. Oh, I don't have the. Is there a steelbook for the? For the uh, for Uncharted Three, I'm not sure if there is. Um, <clears throat> I got the collector's edition, but I don't think there's there was a steel book. I don't think I think that was before steel books became like a big thing, um, where every collector's edition has one, which is cool. I like steel books. So anyway, not really steel though; they're just metal. But whatever. Steel book is just the brand name, I guess. Anyway. Anyway, now I got hiccups. So there you go. That is cool. Um, awesome, awesome box. Thank you so much. I got hiccups. Anyway, there you go. Everything's wrong with me today. Goodbye.